Welcome to Wednesday Web Chat. This is Carl Lewis, your host from Vision 33. And today our topic is going to be going deeper with version 10, analytics. And our special guest will be Avin Owen Frankel of SAP, uh, who uh, I saw him do this presentation and just said, I really need to have him do this for you. And our special guest today is Avinoam Frankel. Avinoam, I'm going to make you presenter, my friend, and uh, turn over the controls to you so that you can uh, show us all about the new analytics in the web plan. Carl, thank you so much. It's a real pleasure to be here, and thank you for inviting me. As I mentioned, my name is Avinoam Frankel. I'm from the SAP Business One product management team. And I would like to share with you our uh, wonderful new web client analytics functionality that uh, is already released in version 10, patch level 2. I want to share with you the vision that we have for web client analytics. And most importantly of all, I would like to set an expectation for this uh, presentation that by the time we get to the end of it, every single one of you will want to have our new web client working side by side with your uh, on-premise desktop. So with that in mind, uh, let me introduce you to what you're looking at. The screen you're looking at is our new web client screen. And I'm going to focus on a, I'm going to start by focusing on a, a new innovation within our web client screen called the list view screen. So without further ado, let's just open one up so you can relate to what I'm talking about. We're going to open up the list view screen for the uh, sales invoices and the concept of the list view in the web client, it's a, uh, a new uh, navigation and uh, access tool for our, uh, our documents and our master data. And every document and every master data screen in the system will eventually be uh, additionally accessible via this list view concept that I say that in addition to the uh, the normal point of access of just opening up the document or the master data screens in the normal way. So we're looking at a list view, uh, which is showing us a list of our invoices. And of course we can uh, click on any row here and open up an invoice. But what I wanna focus on, just highlight the fact that we're looking at a list here. We see various fields of the uh, data underpin uh, um, coming from the actual document itself and let's just review the uh just look at uh, absorb what we're looking at 